All right, we're on the undercarriage of this nice 94, 43,000 mile XJS six cylinder Cabriolet. Uh, you'll note right away, we have brand new set of tires. See how clean all the suspension is. Nice the bushings are. Suspension's tight, bushing's good here. Everything's dry. Came from a rust-free area of the country. So rust is not an issue. Look at this, rear main seal is dry. Everything is dry. Unusual, almost an oxymoron for a Jaguar. Clean floorboards. Uh, somewhere uh, along the line, and I've talked to the shop, and I was unclear what they did, but this rear end was dropped and items replaced. I'll try to get some good light for you. See all these components are brand new up in here. See how shiny and crisp everything is. Exhaust is good also. Um, I will, if the car interests you, by the time we talk, I will have the answer of what was done back here. You can see all the U-joints are clean and new. These plates are new. All these bolts are new. So we will find out why it was and what they did, but it's been done. So nice clean undercarriage. Look at that, all the clips are clean and white. About as good as you get on an old car. This car is a 1994. Let me bring it down a bit. All right, uh, for those of you that's been following my videos, you know why I put it at eye level. Uh, the reason is, is because uh, for years and years, I would buy cars and then put them on the trailer and see items that I had not seen when the car was down on the ground. You learn quickly that you need to put the car at eye level and you'll see mars and scratches and dings and dents that you didn't see when the car was on the ground. So with that in mind, let's start. Um, about 98% of the XJSs that I get through here, which I do a lot of them, uh, this corner is scuffed and scratched. Uh, this one is clean except here. Uh, pretty easy fix, $150, $200, we could have this sprayed. I chose to leave it because it's original. Um, the reason this corner is always scuffed on these XJSs is in your cockpit, this corner is a hard corner to see, kind of a blind spot. So almost all of them are damaged on this corner. Not bad compared to what I see. Uh, these spoilers are low. They always get broken. These are cracked. This one's not. Clean across here. This corner is clean, of course, but this corner is not a blind spot. The nose of the car is clean. Seal beams are clean and not damaged. Pretty, pretty, pretty color. Flamenco red, I think. I'll have to check with Jaguar to see what color this is. No door dings down the side. Look how straight the sides are. Perfect. Look at that reflection, that MGB GT in there. These moldings are tastefully done, which is wonderful because this body line sticks out and doors hit. Uh, so this was tastefully done in body color. So nicely done, blends in well with the car. Original wheels, none of them are damaged. They all have good color, good factory color. The center caps are not faded and cracked. They're fresh and crisp. I'll walk around the other side. And you'll note how clean, well, first of all, the wheel. Center cap's nice again. They look new. Maybe they've been, oh, here was something I noticed. This gentleman has spent the money and put um, shields uh, on the back side of these wheels to prevent the brake dust from building up on these wheels. And let me tell you, these wheels are a booger to keep clean. So he's, again, tastefully done. Did the brake dust shields on all four corners so the wheels stay looking that nice. No wheel damage, no curb damage. Little scuffing here on the bumper. Fenders are nice. And 
once again the sides are straight body moldings are nice what a pretty color you can see how straight it is nice wheels Lenses are in good condition. Bumpers in good condition. And back to the side and you can see once again, I'll give you a set. Look at the reflection of those TR6s in that paint. For you Jaguar enthusiasts, uh, the car sitting in front of it is a real rare car, the white XJS. That's a rare factory, five speed, six cylinder, XJS. They built 50 of them, and that is one of them. A little glimpse of this car because it is so rare. Uh, it's rare enough where uh, these are both 94 cars and both have equal miles. Uh, this car is a good $15,000 more than the red car because of the singular transmission, manual transmission item. Uh, one of 50 built right there So that's been going to market. This one's gonna be 33 5. I'll probably price this at 16 5 I'll get the car down and show you the car on the top. All right, we're gonna look at the top side of this 94 XJS convertible 47,000 miles Absolutely beautiful red paint again. I need to check with Jaguar. I think it's called flamenco red I'd have to check the color code. Doesn't matter what it's called, it's called pretty. It's called beautiful. Just look how straight and beautiful this car is. Absolutely stunning car for the age. Straight, clean, crisp, no accident history, VIN numbers on all the quarter panels, fenders, doors showed on the underside it's dry it's had some nice maintenance it's got a brand new top this is a downside not the new tops a downside it's a good side um, has a brand new top but when they put the top on they did not put the loops for the boot these have loops uh, so it has a boot but they did not put the loops in here nice top nice black canvas top everything works properly beautiful interior look at how crisp the leather is all the wood there's no cracking anywhere there's no warping on the dash no cracks in the center console original radio has the CD player in the trunk of course the back seats always look brand new Sun visors are crisp All the gaps are good because the car has never been in trouble. Pretty color that I should be taking outside in the sunshine so you can see how brilliant it is. But I'm not going to. This is what you get. Beautiful, beautiful XJS. Drives as nice as it looks. seats that bolster that normally shows where is not no lights on no rust no accident non-smoker 47,723 miles and there it is